Hi guys and welcome back to my channel, hope you're all doing well. Um, today I'm coming at you with a haul, um, as always I couldn't fit everything in this frame um, so this is just a snippet of what's to come but yeah if you're interested then please consider liking and subscribing and let's go on with the video. Okay so let's start with Paper Dove Shop. So um, Alex left me a really cute little note which I love, I always put these either in my journal or up next to my desk I've got like a little board I put them on there which is really cute so let's go into this first so we get this cute journaling card really nice I think it's about a b6 size I might be wrong but that's really cute then I got this little sticker with some birds on it and it says don't worry in gold foil really love that um, and then um, Alex was very kind and sent over some of the um, new um, planet tails and things so she very kindly gifted me one which was really sweet of her so these were the moon ones um, and I got one in pink and one in blue I can't remember the exact nail um, names of them but we'll we'll just call them pink and blue for now um let me just oh there we go so this is the pink moon one um and she like i said she embroiders these herself i don't know if i already said that i think i did <laughs> and then this is the end really pretty so that's the pink one so that's a planner tail and then i also got the blue one which I really love. So there's the embroidered bit and there's the end bit. So cute. Love it. She's so talented. Um, and yeah, I just, oh, they get modeled up. I really love those. Then I also got one of her albums. Um, just because they're so much smaller, I thought they'd be great for traveling with like small sheets um, if I ever need to keep them so I haven't folded it yet there we go so you have your um, design on the front there was a few different designs I chose this one so cute and then they're really thick sturdy material which I really like and there's a little pocket here then you get some sleeves top loading sleeves um, and then at the end you have another pocket as well and it's a really really nice thick material actually it's like a thick kind of plasticky material it's really nice um really sturdy so yeah it's a bit floppy at the moment but once i fill it up with things i think it'll be a lot better but yeah so that was everything i got from paper dove shop thank you so much alex i love you lots and yeah definitely check her out on etsy okay next up we're gonna go with um style planner who is i think i've bought from her before um i think this will be my second purchase from her but i absolutely love her stuff i actually placed two separate orders and um, which is what this is because one was a two dollar tuesday and one was a regular order um she comes up with different kind of like themes and designs each month and she i'm pretty sure she hand draws all of them um and i just couldn't resist uh the oh, what's the july i want to say july collection um so yeah we'll go into the two dollar tuesday one first okay so here is the journaling cards it just says i'm creating the life of my dreams really nice i love that um and then here are the two dollar tuesday sheets so this was the freebie really nice and functional I love that and then here are the two dollar Tuesday ones so I got them on um, transparent matte I believe you could get them on either transparent matte or premium matte I don't know if I need to zoom you in a little bit or is that too close maybe that's a bit too close so um, let's go through them so first up we've got this one really nice very beachy this one's very calming I found very like minimalist another beachy one I don't know I'm doing like, like this foil because there isn't another very summery one another very summery one this one reminds you of a hotel in um, California in Beverly Hills I can't is it the Wiltshire 
the Beverly Hills Wiltshire. Um, my dad and I stayed there when we did a little like road trip around America when I was 14. And it just reminds me of the bit by the pool there. I don't know if it is um, a picture from there, but it just reminds me of it. And then this last one, I love all the green and like the terracotta colour. So those are all on um, transparent matte. I believe she still has them in her shop, but they probably won't be $2, I presume the um, price would have changed. So then let's go into the other order. So again, I got the same journaling card and then I got lots of her different things for this collection. It was a Desert Bougie collection, she called it. So first off is this like swatch sheet. I got this on transparent matte, so I can show you. And these are neutral, like desert sand colors love that then we got the monthly in a die cut I believe it's a sticker is it a sticker yeah it is. it's just peeling off there I won't waste your time with me trying to pull it off fully but it is a sticker <laughs> um, another freebie another great functional one and these are like boxes you could add into the collection this is on normal mat a normal premium mat I love these patterns, really nice. This is to go with the monthlies. So I got it for the Hobonichi cousin. So you've got um, like a toolbox here, your washi strips, um, your date covers, some like swatches, a little clipboard, and then obviously your numbers and script. I believe that came with it. I don't think it was an add-on love that then I got these circles again perfect for journaling and these are on the transparent matte paper then I also got them in premium matte as well then I got some of these they're just black florals on I believe transparent matte I can't get it up yeah they are on transparent map love those um i got some swatches some more swatches these are patterned ones on the premium mat and then on the transparent mat then these are called they're like vellum uh like mini dashboards cards uh so first off got this print is it what's that called it's not bird's paradise i can't remember the name of the plant all those plant lovers out there let me know <laughs> a cactus this one i love i don't know what's so aesthetically pleasing about about cacti but i don't know and succulents i just find them really calming <laughs> this one it's all on like a vellum paper or vellum not a vellum paper and this one i love then i got some more of these boxes on premium mat in a different design love them with the washi tape Got another one of these, um, like I showed you on the $2 Tuesday. And then this is part of the weekly um, cousin kit. So you have this page with some full boxes, some clipboards, some of those florals. Again, I love that grid washi throughout. Then some uh, washi date covers, some headers, some check um, list like points, um, and some other like boxes and things as well. I love that so I've pretty much got everything from that collection um but yeah that was everything I got from the style planner now I have an order from um Carolyn Designs I loved I was just so excited when I saw this I just absolutely loved it she did like a 90s kind of thing I think it might be for her birthday but I just thought it was so fun I couldn't resist so first up I got this planner charm which is a dinosaur now i'm a real geek when it comes to things like this i love dinosaurs i don't know what it is i just find them fascinating i love jurassic world jurassic park i love going to in london like the natural history museum um with the dinosaur exhibit i just i love them so i thought this was really fun it's very like 90s so cute um and then this is the other end so it's quite short so you just tie it around probably the bottom ring off your planner and your rings planner and then it would dangle at the bottom but i just thought that was so cute i just couldn't resist it and then the other thing was these paper clips 
to get them all out. So these are like gummy bear paper clips. So I got them as a, I think they only came as a set, if I'm not wrong. Oh, I don't know, I'm just going to leave that for now. Um, but yeah, so there's this, the orange and purple one, the yellow one, red one. They've all got like an iridescent finish to them. A light pink one. A dark pink one and then like a lime green one so I just thought they were so cute and so different um, and yeah like I said it was just kind of like a nostalgic childhood thing that I was really excited about so yeah that was what I got from Carolyn Plans or Carolyn Design sorry <laughs> Okay, next up I have an order from Odd Loop. So she released some Animal Crossing washi and some more like Disney things, so I couldn't resist getting those. So let's go into the washi tape first. So here we have the Animal Crossing one. It's got gold foil on it, I don't know if you can see. I have got it rolled out in my cousin, but it's not, it's in the other room and I'm really tired and I can't bother to go get it, but I'll show you here. So. You've got Tom Nook, the museum, um, the town hall, or resident services, the Able Sisters, and then um, the Dodo Airlines. And then it repeats itself. Um, but I just thought that was really cute. Um, it's all her own like design. So yeah, I just thought that was really unique. Um, and then I got the stamps for the Pixar collection, I think. So we have first off we have Earth, obviously from Wally, -E, Radiator Springs for Cars, Ratatouille, uh, Land of the Dead for Coco, the Door for Monsters Inc., um, the Great Before I'm not sure about, um, Paradise Falls for Up, then Pizza Planet for Toy Story. Oh. Barrier Reef for um, Finding Nemo, Train of Thought for, um, oh my gosh, it's one of my favourites, Inside Out. So yeah, so they are like stamp ones, you just pull off each bit. I'm not going to do that now, just because I'm not going to use it right now, but um, yeah. So I just thought, I love stamp washi anyway, I think it's just like a thing, isn't it? Everyone loves stamp washi. Um, it seems to be getting quite popular. For lots of companies to do them but i think it's just because it's so cute and aesthetically pleasing uh, then i got some like vinyl stickers so i got some of the disney like stamps and then some animal crossing things so let's start with the disney stamps first so i got arendelle for um frozen and it's funny because where i live there's a town near us called Arundel, um, and we always used to joke that it was from Frozen. Rapunzel's Tower from Tangled, my favourite. Seeking Beauty Castle, Montanui, which is obviously, sorry, Montanui, it's obviously Moana. And then Neverland, which is Peter Pan. Then moving on to the Animal Crossing ones. So we've got maple, maple syrup, so cute. Cocoa water. Home buying for dummies, for Tom Nook, although well, it looks like one of Timmy or Tommy. Uh, Leaf's potting mix, I love Leaf, he's adorable. Tia T, so cute. 100% Tangy OJ. If anyone else seen the meme where Tangy's drinking orange juice and then it just pounced her, like looking confused because obviously she is an orange. <laughs> uh, Blather's Guide to Fossils, I thought this was really cute, I think this was my favourite. Then a Blathers Museum ticket, so cute. A Red's Cousin discount card. And then a uh, frequent flyer for the Dodo Airlines. So yeah, um, that was everything I got from Oddly, all adorable. Don't forget to go check them out. Okay, so next up I have Letters to Apollo. Um, I have a kit, a $2 Tuesday order, and then 
some vellum. Don't forget you can use a Saskia 10 to save and receive my freebie which I'll show you in a second. So let's get on to the $2 Tuesday first. So first off, look at this packaging. So cute. I love it. I love the, did you just do a happy dance? I think you did on the bottom. I think that's so cute. So let's zoom you in a bit. So here is um, Colors Freebie from Pretty Planner Pages. Love it. And then here's my freebie. Super cute. Uh, then I just got a few um, like nautical themed $2 Tuesdays. So here are the infinity knots in rose gold, the knot circle in rose gold, Ooh. the dolphin and anchors mandala in rose gold, in gold, and in silver. So they were the $2 hollers. So this kit is sunshine. I think it's probably. I want to say my favorite like summery kit she's done I just think it's gorgeous like the colors um, I love the pink yellow green and blue together and then it's got uh, is it I want to say light gold foiling so this is called sunshine we'll do a closer up a close up <laughs> of the full boxes the middle box says friends bring sunshine on a cloudy day so cute very like picnic themes could be used for spring or summer then here's your other page you've got headers some sidebar things some checklists and some really cute like functional items like these boxes flags and things love it then your boxes page oh, is it weird i just want to frame this <laughs> i think it's so pretty again these colors are just oh I just love them i should have bought another one of these kits maybe i have to buy another one to hoard <laughs> but i love these different kind of boxes you have up here the mix between patterned boxes with the white up in the middle and then the normal boxes. The little details. Look at the bee and the thing. Oh my god, I compare my bee stuff with this. Perfect. We all now have so many bee things. <laughs> and then your uh, date covers and washi and some more layering items as well. Gorgeous. So that is Sunshine. Probably one of my favourite kits she's ever done. <laughs> Love that. I think it's, I believe it's still in the shop. And then the vellum, which I think was part of the $2 holler, but I could be wrong. Because it's nautical themed as well. So I think it was. So first off we have these anchors. Really love that. And then these stripes. Okay, that is the right way up. I don't think it really matters to be honest. <laughs> Um, so, yeah. That was everything I got from Desta Polo. Don't forget to use my code Saskia 10 to save and mention me in the notes to seller for my freebie. Okay, next up I have a few orders from Sadie Stickers. I have um, a PR order, some $2 Tuesdays, and some vellum, which I believe was part of the $2 Tuesdays. So, yeah, let's get into the $2 Tuesdays first. I can't remember which kits I ordered which $2 Tuesdays, so we'll just do the kits last. <laughs> Probably be the easiest way to do it. So, first off is my freebie. This is my older one. It has been updated now. Um, so, check out my Instagram, Pumpkin Plans, or Alicia's Instagram, Sadie Stickers, to um, see the new updated one. This is my old one in silver foil. You can use Saskia 20 to save. Uh, that hasn't changed. And obviously, mention me in the notes to get my freebie. So, picked up a few things. I've picked up quite a lot, actually. Um, I can never resist her $2 Tuesdays. So, first off are the floral mini circles in rose gold, silver, and gold. Her gold's more like a matte gold. Um, and that they're on premium matte paper. Then we have the floral cluster drop on clear. It's the rose gold. The detail on that, I love it. Silver and gold. Then the floral border third boxes in rose gold on white paper. Silver and gold. 
Um, and then I got another rose gold and another silver. Oh no, sorry, these are the quarter boxes. And then gold. Then I got the floral border dividers. I just love how dainty these are. So they're on clear, so that's the rose gold, silver, and gold. Then the daisy stem deco on clear, rose gold, silver, gold. And then some daisy deco on rose gold, silver, and gold. So that was that $2 Tuesday. And then let's move on to this one. So this was a more summery kind of theme. So I got the Monstera, uh, Monstera circles in rose gold on white, silver, and gold. Then um, Monstera dividers in rose gold on clear, silver, and gold. Then I grabbed some vellum as well as part of the $2 Tuesday deal. So first off I got this, um, like, uh, is it Monstera leaves? I get confused with the different leaves. Um, I'm not a plant person if you can't tell. I kill pretty much every plant I touch. Um, I wish I was better though. <laughs> but this is like a, like I said, I think it's like a Monstera print on a very pale pink. I don't know if you can see the pale pink very well on the camera. But it is a pale pink with the leaves on. I love that. Really nice, thick quality vellum as well. Then I have these leaves, which are on a like pale yellowy colour background. And then, last but not least, the leopard brum. Which I really love as well. Like I said, I love the quality. It's really thick vellum, it's really nice. But yeah, so those were the vellums for $2 Tuesday. Then now getting onto the kit. So I believe I ordered the May and the June ones and then she threw these two in um, as extras because she is really generous and she does do that sometimes with our PR orders which is really sweet. So I can't remember which was um, from which order whatever so I'll just show you them all. Um, so let's start with this one first because it's the older format so this is Saturday I've wanted this kit for ages um, I love it it is in the older format but still a great format and I believe it's still in her shop so first off we have the headers which are an add-on this kit is in gold foil then here we have the full boxes um, in gold and in her older format the top bits here are flags if you can see the cut lines so but I just love the colors in this it feels like a like March February March day in London so this box reminds me of although I think it's Paris <laughs> um, but that's the kind of vibe it gives me so close up the full boxes love it so you can see all right the light um so there's the full boxes then you have your boxes page and some like sidebar things down the bottom here headers and layering items and checklists some more boxes as well I love these details and then your bottom washi and day covers so that was Saturday um, and as I said I believe it's still in the shop most of her older format kits um, last time I checked were still in the shop so you can still pick them up Okay, then let's go through the monthly kits in order. Um, so when Alicia releases a new monthly monthly kit, <laughs> um, she also releases a weekly kit with the same art, which is really cool, so you can match them. So um, this is May, June and July. So we'll go through May first. And they all do now have a add-on sheet, which is a deco sheet. So here's the deco sheet for May. So you get some deco up here, some clip art deco, and then some boxes. This shape's my favourite, I love the squares. And then let's get into the kit. So this is forward in gold foil. Gorgeous. The quote box says, like a butterfly, her wings unfolded. So sweet. 
I've never really been too into butterflies. I've always thought they're beautiful, but I've never had like a, a fascination as much. But I love seeing them in kits now and in people's journaling and things now. Uh, so on the new format, instead of there being stuff at the top, there's now stuff at the bottom. So you've got um, some labels with some confetti on. Then some icons, which are foiled, and there's like confetti at the top. And your boxes. But lots of people came out with floral um, stuff with this floral pattern as well. I don't know if that made sense, but you know what I mean. <laughs> then you have your three lots of headers down the side, some sidebar items and some layering things, and then some checklists at the bottom. And then your bottom washi and date covers. I just love it. I love this box here. That's really nice. Yeah, so that is the new format, or the newest format, I should say. Um, it's not really new now, <laughs> um, of Sadie Stickers Kit. So that was the May collection, weekly. Then we have the June collection. So again, your deco add-on. I love these colours, the blue and the like corally pink, so nice. Your full boxes, this is foiled in silver foil. The quote box says sunshine on my mind. I think this is one of my favourite monthlies she's done so far. I just love it. I'll just go through it quite quickly because it's the same format. How cute is this little orange or lemon? Or lime. <laughs> A little starfish. Headers, functional things. Love this pattern and this blue colour. And then bottom washing day covers. So pretty. So that was the June weekly collection. And then last but not least, we have the July collection. So your deco add on. I love this like leopard print box. And then the kit. This is in gold foil. I have a kit um, with this clip art from last year from, I want to say, Paper Muse Crafts, and I loved it. So I'm so excited that Alicia's done one with it this year. And your last page, I just love this, like the muted mint green with the pink. I've said before how much I love that combination. The gold foil and the leaves, oh, it's just great. Maybe this is my favourite weekly clothes she's done. I think it's a tie. <laughs> so, yeah, that was everything I got from Sadie Stickers. Don't forget to use my code Sasuke20 to save and mention me in the notes for my freebie. Okay, next up is a new to me um, shop. I believe she's in the UK or it might be Europe, um, but I just thought her stuff was super cute, so I thought I'd try it out. So this is Ellie in Opal. She wrote me a little note that says, Hi Saskia, thank you so much for supporting my small biz. Enjoy. Um, and I've just covered up this bit here because there is a discount code for once you've ordered once for your next order. And I didn't really want to show that just because it's not really fair if you haven't ordered <laughs> um, on her. So yeah, so I thought I'll show you the little like vinyls I got. Uh, so this is just roll with it. I love cinnamon rolls, I just thought this was hilarious. So I love that. And this one's like a little sticky note. It says, note, it's okay to not be okay. So cute, such a good message. And then, let me slip it off, there you go. <laughs> this one that says, you are allowed to be happy. So just some like cute motivational ones. Um, but yeah, I thought it was really cute. It came really um, quickly. And yeah, just loved it. This is the journaling card that came with it. And yeah, so definitely go and check out Ellie and Opal. I believe, believe it was on, it was a Shopify store. I don't think she's on Etsy, um, but definitely go check her on Instagram at Ellie and Opal to see. Next up is another new to me shop. This is Latoon. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, she is on Etsy and she just has the cutest like journaling stickers and things. So I thought these would be really fun for my home and each cousin, like dailies and weeklies and stuff. Um, and yeah, just sprinkling around my planner. So here is the freebie. Really sweet, I love it. Um, and then I got a bullet journal sticker sheet. I got a few of those. I think she threw in two of some of them. 
because I don't think I ordered two of some of them. Um, but so thank you so much if you did. But this is the first sheet. So you've just got like a little kettle, days of the week, little like um, tracker, little stamps and things. Just so cute. I presume she draws these herself. They're really fun. So I got the bullet journal sticker sheet. I got that one, which she very kindly sent me two of. And then this other one, which is the same format, but a different design. I love these like wax seals. It's so sweet. And yeah, I just thought that was nice again. Thank you for sending me two. Um, and then I got the aesthetic book sticker sheet. I did also get the washi that matched this, but I think I put it away or I might have, I think I might have used it at work, so it might be in my drawer at work. Um, don't worry, it's hidden, like, so the kids can't get hold of it, um, because <laughs> it's beautiful. Um, but yeah, so I don't have it on me right now, but definitely go check it out on her Etsy. It's gorgeous. So that was the sticker sheet. And then I got, um, two planner sticker sheets. So they've got tasks and things, leave for later notes at the top. I like this, like, little movie ticket. Some circles and then some more days of the week. So again, I could probably use this in my cousin. As like a weekly or daily and then another pattern the moths always make me think of katie from plan with katie <laughs> so i love that very soft colors very calming looking at these um and then the spring garden sticker sheet you know i love my rainbows how cute is this it's like a little thing hanging up i must say that i do wish these little designs in the background were stickers as well as like little fillers because i think they're really cute but yeah, so that was everything I got from Latoon. Definitely check her out on Etsy and on Instagram. Um, amazing quality, came really quickly, um, and yeah, just love them. Okay, next up I have an order from um, Raspberry L Designs. I want to apologise if my voice sounds different. I've got a really bad cold, um, so my throat and nose are a bit funny at the moment so if I sound different that's why because I'm filming this a different day um but yeah so let's get into Raspberry L designs so first off is this freebie which is really cool very patriotic colors and then I believe this was she does like two dollar Tuesdays um where like each sheet is two dollars or something like that so she released a bookish collection and you know I've got to have it <laughs> so I got two of the deco sheets they're just normal uh, premium matte paper then I picked up the I think this might be the B6 kit or it might be the normal kit I'm not sure but I just thought this would be nice um, I could use it in my B6 my PP um print pressure b6 spiral if needed i really need to get into that planner um i've had it for ages and i keep meaning to use it let me know if you have any ideas what i could use it for uh but i thought if not that would work in there so you just have your full boxes and then your date covers some like sidebar stuff some boxes and some washi strips at the bottom so that was really cool and then she also did it in a hobonichi cousin format so obviously i had to grab that so here's the first page I'll turn on its side so you can see the washi as well so you got your washi your date covers two lost date covers some boxes some sidebar um, things and then this is the other page so you've got some more boxes some more um, functional boxes some more sidebar stuff and some like functional headers as well so that was everything that I got from Raspberry L Designs. Okay, now I have a quite large order from Squirrel Brunts Co. She's been releasing lots of like Disney um, themed stickers and I know I said last year I was doing a Disney planner, I didn't really end up doing it. Um, I got so far behind because of life, like with my normal planner, there's no way I could have kept up with that one as well. So I only put down the spread for like the first few weeks of January, so I thought I'll just do it for next year instead because I hadn't filled out the spreads. So um, I kind of put a few of the kits in my cart and then 
when I had a few accumulated I purchased. So let's go through it. So first off I got this uh, rack bag which is really cool. Um, so I got this these rose gold scripts on like a sampler. Rose gold headers and bow headers. These which are really cute. I think, are they called scribblers? Then these are all parts of a kit. I don't know which kit but let me know um, if you know or if you have this kit and I'm happy to send them to you. Um, but I just love it when she does that. I think that's a really nice um, freebie pack to get. Then I got some uh, vinyls. So I think they're vinyls. Yeah, they are. Um, so they're just like little boarding passes. But how cute are they? There's flight to plan a piece. Um, passenger plan a babe. I just thought they were really cool. So I got it in sparkly hollow, uh, like a sparkly gold, is that gold hollow? Um, and then rose gold hollow. Love those, I thought they'd be cute in the front of my planner or in a pocket or something. Um, then I picked up some wax melt stickers, because she now has icons which are really cool. And oh, I think this was another freebie as well, a hollow um, script sampler. So then going into the kits, I picked up four kits. Um, let's go into this one first. So this was the kit for the um, 50th anniversary of Walt Disney World, which obviously was, was it October the 1st, I think it was, and it's gonna run for a year and a half. So I was hoping, if I ever did get to go, that I'd be able to use this kit. Um, but obviously it will depend on COVID and everything because I don't really want to... I was saying to a friend, it's not going to another country that worries me. It's sitting on a flight for like eight, nine hours with people who don't know if they're vaccinated, you don't know where they've been, if they've been near someone with COVID. Um, and I mean, I always get ill usually from a plane anyway because obviously it's just circulating air and people are from all over the place. So it's, you're bound to get ill anyway. But... With COVID as well, I'm just not sure I'm ready for that yet. So, um, yeah, well, I'll leave that there. I don't want to get too into that on this channel. But, yeah, so if we get to go, it'll be great. If we don't, we don't. Um, I might just use this kit for the week of the anniversary. But, yeah, I just thought it was cute and it was gorgeous colours. So I couldn't resist. So I'll go through the extras I got first. So I picked up the doodle icons that were in the colourway, which I love. Then it came with this free uh, sidebar girl, which I love. Look at her dress. It's so cute. Is it one of those? Is it called a selkie? They're like puffy dresses. But I just love it. She just looks great. Oh, and then I also got Fam 3, this extender add on as well. Because I already have the toolbox, obviously. I can use this one. Um, but I wanted these two, and it came with another one. So I love this so aesthetically pleasing <laughs> then I grabbed the washi add-on as well because I like to put an overlay over that and then let's get into the kit so I think this is the mini yeah this is the mini so you have your full boxes so pretty lots of deco love the little autograph book I used to love doing that when I was younger even now to be honest when Adam and I went a few years ago I still did it <laughs> and then this page so you've got some more functional stuff, you've got some glitter headers included, some movie marquees, some boxes. I love this colour, a deep blue purple colour. And then your bottom washing day covers. So that was the magical um, 50th kit. Next up, let's go into this kit. So this is the um, Oh Bother kit. So this came with a script sampler. Um, and then this is the kit, so I believe again, this is a mini, yeah. Um, oh, and I also got the 15mm washi add-on. Um, I love this kit, I picked it up just because Adam loves Winnie the Pooh, um, and so do I, so I thought we could use it as like an anniversary thing, he loves it a lot more than I do, but I just thought it'd be cute, or for his birthday, or about three of my friends. Two of my friends have had babies recently, and one's announced they're pregnant, so I feel like this would be good for like a baby shower, or one of their birthdays or like I said just for Adam's birthday or an anniversary so just loved it it's so cute I mean look at the little macaroon oh so cute I love it in the book so cute 
So these are your full boxes. Again, it's the same format. So I'll just quickly flip through. So that was Oh Bother. So this is part of your world. So again, the script sampler and the 50mm washi. Um, this is the ultimate kit though, I think. So you got your full boxes. I just love the more kind of like subtle, well it's not really subtle is it, but you know what I mean, the kind of more grown up way of doing it. I just love this cartoon as well. It's so cute. This is why I wanted the ultimate because I love this record player. And the little flounder, who wouldn't want that? So you definitely get a lot more things I've seen in Ultimate. I love this purple and the like bluey green on your bottom washi. So that was part of your world. And then this is How Far I'll Go, which is the Moana inspired kit. This is a mini. So again, 50mm washi add-on. Um, I think this was a freebie toolbox yeah it is it says there moana doesn't she look great um and then yeah so again mini kits the same format just have the little pua so cute and yeah so that was how far i'll go so that was everything i got from squirrel prince co Okay, the next shop is The Giving Girl. Um, I have taken out the packaging, but I did want to show you the packaging just because it's always amazing. So how cute is this? The Sparkly Hollow sticker, and it's literally just like a folder. Like you could actually store stuff in there. Oh, it's just gorgeous. Absolutely love it. So I just wanted to show you that because Jennifer's packaging was knocks it out of the park. So um, I got a few freebies. So first I got this washi card that just says let love guide you. I love that. Then I got this freebie which is the Facebook freebie. So if you mention you're in the Facebook group, if you are in the Facebook group, um, in the notes teller you get extra freebies. This was the June freebie. And then this was the normal freebie. How cute is that in gold foil? It's a little drink, hot cocoa and a leaf. How cute. Then I picked up two lots of things. So we'll go through this one first. So first up I picked up the washi sticky notes in every colorway i want to say yes so they're all in gold foil but you've got the ash gray ones the almost is it mauve 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 everyone says it differently here <laughs> um again mauve chiffon and then powder pink so i thought i'd try i only got them in gold because i wanted to try seeing how I feel about playing with them because I've never used them before so just kind of play around them in my spreads and then I got the bow box sampler so I got two I got the cream gingham in all four foils it's quite a large page so I'm trying to do it all so that's gold silver and rose gold love those and then the grey, sorry, the sea salt gingham. It's like a light blue grey in gold, silver, and rose gold. Then I picked up the summer kit in silver. I'm pretty sure it's because I saw um, Justine from Just Plans using it in a plan with me, and I was like, how did I not pick that kit up? I need to get it. So I got it. Justine's always enabling me, but I'm, I'm not complaining about it. So um, this is the matching deco that you could purchase. Super cute. And then this is the kit. So her format is just insane. Um, I love it. Absolutely love it. So here are your full boxes. And these are all little icons down the side, like teardrop shaped ones. Then you have your date covers, some headers, some um, all like little flags, and some bottom washi. I just love this like, little pebble print, so cute. A lot like the beaches here in the UK, most of them are pebble beaches. <laughs> um, and then you have your boxes. I mean, look at this variety of boxes. It's amazing, like, you've got some bowstrung ones, some like dangle ones, some pretty plain ones. 
so I love the variety. And this page is probably my favourite. So you get more headers, some sidebar things, and lots of different like box shapes and layering items, and some icons. And even some script flags. So cool. So yeah, that is the um, summer kit from The Giving Girl. And that is everything that I picked up. Okay, the next shop is Two Little Bees. I'm sure it's no surprise to anyone that I picked up like three kits. Um, I love Maria, I love her shop. And also coming into the autumn, winter, winter kind of seasonal time is the best because Maria's autumn and winter kits are always incredible. And so are her spring and summer ones, but I especially love her autumn and winter ones. So I'm excited for that. But anyway, let's get into these ones. So this was the freebie. And what a nice freebie that is. They're like little dividers. I love it. Then this journaling card that says maybe she's a wildflower. And this is the art for, is it Poppy, I think? Which is one of my favourite kits, like summary kits she's done so far. Other than the bee one, obviously. But look how cute that is. And it's really nice, like, linen texture. Then if we go into the kits, um, like I said, I bought quite a lot. So let's go into this one first. So this is Boho Rainbow in rose gold. So I picked up the deco. How cute. Look at this dress with the rainbows on. Is that not just the cutest thing you've ever seen? And the, the cactus, like paper clip. I love it. And the, oh, just obsessed. So this is the uh, mini I think she only has mini kits now and then you like add on the extra page but I could be wrong I think that's right though so here are your full boxes for Boho Rainbow and then you have this extra bit is it a washi strip at the bottom I don't know if it is a washi strip I think it is if not you could cut it to be a washi strip I just love those full boxes with the rose gold foil. Then we have this page. So you've got some script headers, some normal headers. You could put some foil overlays on if you wanted to. Um, some flags. And I love the variety of sizing here. Um, then these boxes, some more of that deco. Look, there's that paper clip again. <laughs> and a little weekend script. Oh, that little leaf as well. I love that. Then some icons. Which I love. I think it would be nice if these were foiled, um, but I like them in black as well because then you can pull them into any spread. Um, some boxes, some stuff for your sidebar, and some checklists. Then your date covers, some more headers, and bottom washi, and you've got an extra strip of washi here as well. How gorgeous is that? So, oh, sorry. And then this is the functional add on page. There we go. So I'm pretty sure it's mini kits, and then you add this on if you want to. So you have some floral deco, some boxes, some like scallops, some corners, some more like layering items. I love this one here. Some more labels, some more boxes, some more layering things. I mean the variety is just incredible. And this not all being floral, you could take this into like a Christmas spread or a spring spread or a neutral spread, any time spread, um, because the colours, it's just blocked so it's just great. So yeah, that is Boho Rainbow. I hope I don't sound too out of breath. I literally, with this cold, I'm struggling to like talk for a long time and like breathe properly at the same time because I can't really breathe out my nose. So it's a fun time to be had. Um, but yes, yeah, so this is Poppy, which I said was one of my favourites. Just the colours in it just pops. Um, <laughs> Poppy, that's funny. Um, and I'm pretty sure she said she made this after... I think that was a bag or something or one of the designer brands made something with a similar pattern that inspired her something like that um but i just love it i think it's gorgeous so first off i got the deco again i like it because if i don't use this in the kit i could use it by journal in my home beach cousin somewhere then the floral shapes so cute and i'm pretty sure i have some deco from let's do pull sadie sticks to match this as well so cute. Sorry, I have to keep pausing to take a big deep, big deep breath. <laughs> um, so this is the kit. So again, I got like the mini kit with the add-on. So here are your full boxes in gold foil. Can we just appreciate this? And look, there's a bee box. <laughs> You'll know my fascination. So pretty. 
oh just look at this is it weird i just want to kind of like frame this kit because of the colors <laughs> like laminate it and keep it forever <laughs> but that's where i hoard when i shouldn't be but look how beautiful it is it's just like a work of art with these colors do these colors just make me so happy so gorgeous and it's very similar colors to the sunshine kit from letter to apollo that i love as well that i showed earlier so just these colors make me happy so again same format oh just love it i mean that box you could use in an autumnal spread it's gorgeous again plain colors so you could use these ones for any spread not necessarily just this one and then your bottom washi oh look at that green with that pink so cute and then your functional page which oh just knocks me knocks me over i mean it's just gorgeous <laughs> isn't it weird sometimes when you see it a piece of paper with all the stickers on you're like this looks so nice as it is i don't want to use any stickers because i don't want to ruin how it looks does anyone else do that or is that just me being weird probably just me being weird <laughs> but there's this one so there's the functional page which is the add-on so that beauty was poppy which fun fact i was going to be called poppy um my mum wanted to call me poppy but my dad didn't like it so they didn't call me poppy which is a shame because i love the name but yeah we have sail away so this was a reformat format from last year pretty sure i used it last year as well but you know i love a nautical theme and this like, quote box in the middle i love well not really a quote box but you know what i mean how cute i love the blues with the gold so pretty so your full boxes again same format i believe look at these patterns I love it and then your bottom washi and date covers and headers oh and then the functional add-on and obviously this is newer because she didn't have this last year so cute I love those colors so that was a sail away so that was everything that I picked up from Two Little Bees. Definitely go check Maria out on her website and on her Instagram. Okay, last but not least is my order from Bloom Paper Studio. I picked up a few um, like functional things and then a kit. So I just noticed a little note. I'll just fold it over so you can't see my thingy. Um, but... Sharon says she's included the deco She also for the kit, which I must have forgot to pick up. So that's great. Thank you so much, Sharon. Sharon's always the sweetest. So let's go through the freebies. So there's this, this little floral one, rose gold, then some gold floral. These were on um, these are on white paper. And then, oh, this is the deco sheets. I'll put that with the kit. So then I just picked up the lace boxes 2.0 um, in gold, rose gold, silver, and light gold, which I just love. So you can see kind of the difference between the gold and the light gold. Did I get the gold and the light gold? Yes, I did. So, I love those. I just think they're nice to layer with an icon or some florals or something over them. Nice and simple, but gorgeous. So, this was released for... They now have a dried flower shop called Bloom and Lace. Um, such a cute name, I love it. And they made a kit to celebrate that. So, I was super excited and had to pick it up. So, this is the Bloom and Lace deco sheet. So nice. I love these. Um, and I don't know if she ships internationally with her dry flowers. If she does, I'll have to order. Um, but they're just so gorgeous. Go check out their Instagram. But this is the kit. So you've got your full boxes. It is in rose gold foil. Then we have this page. So you've got some boxes, some like fancy labels, some really cute like fancy labels and boxes. Look at these. And these are like little mandala on. Oh, I love them. And then the date covers, some layering things, some like swatches or swooshes, um, and some like scalloped boxes. Really cool. Even more boxes. I mean, look, you'll never get bored of the amount of boxes in here. They're so different. There's such a great variety. Some lace. Oh, look with even a little flower on. Some layering shapes, some icons. Look at these icons. So cute. Some more boxes. And frames and then you get three sets of headers some washi strips um, some habit trackers and another little flag here so nice I just love the format 
just so unique yeah so that was the bloom and lace kit in rose gold so that was everything i got from bloom paper studio okay that's gonna wrap up today's video thank you so so much for watching sorry my fingers keep like jutting in and out i'll move them um <laughs> thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed it let me know down below um which was your favorite item i showed today or your favorite shop maybe um i had so much fun filming this so many good things to look through um and play with and i'm so excited to get them in my planners but yeah I hope you're all having a good day. Please consider liking, um, dropping a comment if you want to have a chat and subscribing. And don't forget to check out my Instagram, which is also Pumpkin Plans. Perfect. And I'll see you later. Bye.